Hey Matt, this is Devin from SEO Dallas, Texas. Appreciate you taking the time to talk to me the other day. Uh, in this quick video, I'm showing you three easy ways that you can beat your competition online. I'm sure, you're asking, Devin, why are you make me this video? The reality is real simple. I found out a little while back there's a lot of small business owners out there that are spending all their time running their business and taking care of their customers. They don't really have the time to learn how the internet can work for them and make, you know, bring in more of those customers. The only thing that's really holding them back from hiring a marketing agency is not knowing who is an expert and who is not an expert. So I found that by making these attack plans and giving them away for free, a lot of those business owners still end up raising their hand and going, you know what, Devin, I like you, take care of this for me. So if at the end of this you want me to handle this for you, just give me a call, we can chat. If you want to take this information and do it on your own, by all means, that's okay too. This is just free education. Now, Matt, the three things I'm going to go over today are going to be content, backlinks, and citations. Content is anything on the front page of your website that Google can read. So that's all the text on the front page, all the text behind your images, and whatever your images are saved as. Now, to be considered an authority in Google's eyes, you're going to want to have at least 1,500 words on that front page, and you want it to be stuffed with content that has to do with buyer intent. So for you specifically, you'd be looking at like Grand Prairie Plumbers, Plumbers in Grand Prairie, stuff like that. Looking at your page, very easy on the eyes. I like it. Really simple layout. Not too much going on. Uh, really, just, it's a good website to get you know start getting traffic in. Um, Content-wise, you're definitely going to want to boost that. Sorry about that. You're sitting in about probably 100, 150 words. You're going to want to get at least 1,500 words. If you look at your main competition, Grand Prairie Plumbing Bakers Brothers are sitting right on this page at around 1,500 words. And same with Berkey's, probably closer to 1,200, 1,500 words. So again, I'd recommend getting your website up to 1,500 words. In all reality, you're using a Google business site, just a recommendation. I would get your own website just so you can actually own the asset instead of be ranking it. And yeah, it's not, your image should be saved as something that was like Plumber Grand Prairie or something like that. Um, but yeah, definitely I would own your own website. Next thing you want to talk about is going to be backlinks because Google is like a popularity contest. And so they judge you based off of how many other websites are pointing back to you. And not all websites are, or not all backlinks are created equal. You're going to get a lot better effect from a plumber giving you a link than you would from like a, uh, let's see, like a, like a Pizza Hut company giving you a link. So, here's another tool I use for that. It's called ARES. It costs about a thousand bucks a month, depending on what plan you use, but it gives you a lot of really valuable data on what kind of uh, traffic is coming into your website. And it shows that you currently have no referring domains and no backlinks, leading to zero traffic. Uh, let me show you why you want to get that traffic. If you look at Berkey's or Baker Brothers, you have 528 referring domains with 4,507 backlinks leading to 10,000 traffic. And Berkey's, they got 807 websites pointing back at them and 8,300 backlinks leading to 4.9K. This is a good example of how not all backlinks are created equal. These guys have less backlinks, but they have much higher traffic because they're getting better backlinks after the plumbing. So make sure you, when you start adding your backlinks on, I would shoot for about 550 um, websites pointing at you, and make sure they're all within the plumbing niche. Good strategy to that is just click on these guys, see see what websites they're using, take those same ones like Ream, MoveZoo, CityLink, go list yourself on those same ones, and you'll be good. Last thing I want to talk about citations. Citations are important because when someone needs a plumber now, they're gonna pick the first person that comes up they can trust. A lot of people skip these ads because one, they have ad blockers, but two. There's a ton of people who just have had bad experiences with the ads and they stop clicking on them. So where a lot of people go is right here, the Google My Business the local map pack ranking. And again, here, you're going to want to have more citations than your competitors. Citations are anywhere on the internet where your name, your address, and your phone number are listed in different directories. If you're asking what directories are, those are just websites that allow you to list your information. So you're talking about like Yelp, Yext, Facebook, Yellow Pages, White Pages. These are all good examples of, of directories. So what we do with our clients is we have them grab uh, whatever directories their competition is being listed in, list themselves in those exact same directories, and then we add on a good space cushion of about 20 to 30 percent. So once your competition realizes you've taken that number one spot, it'll take them some time to catch up, and you can continually add on backlinks, making sure they never catch up to you and you take all those customers. So that's all I've got for you, Matt. The three things I went over today were content. I'd recommend owning your own website and then getting it up to about 1,500 words of content. Uh, backlinks, you're going to want to shoot for about 500 backlinks pointing back at you. Make sure they're within the plumbing lit niche. Really, you're going to need about 550. Uh, and then citations, you're going to want to go find out what directories your competitors are being listed in. List yourself in those same directories and add on some more. So if you want to do this yourself, by all means, it's totally okay. This is free information. I can even send you a bi-weekly screenshot of your ARAFs account just to keep you up to date and show you what it is so you don't have to spend the 1000 bucks a month. 
If you want me to do this for you, you can check out our website. It's seodallastexas.com. Our phone number is 214-441-6737. If you're on mobile, you can just click right here, and it'll go right to our phones. Appreciate you taking the time to watch this, Matt. I hope you have a great day. Bye.